News Miami. Now at six, tragic developments in the breaking news out of Lauderdale by the sea. We've been following for more than an hour now. Fire rescue officials say one child has died and another remains at Broward General Medical Center after a six foot deep sand hole collapsed on the children at the beach. Let's get right out to CBS News Miami's Anna McAllister with what we know so far. Anna, what can you tell us? Elliot Lauren, this is an absolutely tragic situation. A family just trying to enjoy their day on the beach, just taking a tragic turn. I want to show you over here to the scene that we have of the sand hole. We see that there are the sheriff's office BSO. They're out here investigating the situation. The perimeter is roped off here. Now I want to take you to some video. According to Pompano Fire Rescue, they received a call shortly before 4 p.m. that a boy and a girl, approximately eight and seven years old, were digging a hole on the beach with some adults, and that hole was about five to six feet deep when it collapsed. Good Samaritans on the beach, they tried digging these kids out of the hole. They were trying to hold on to the walls of this hole so it would not collapse further. The boy, he was buried up to his chest and that little girl, she was completely submerged in the sand underneath of him. Pompano Fire, they pulled both, both of them out. The boy who he was taken to Broward General Health where he's in stable condition, but the little girl, she was rushed to another hospital and tragically she was pronounced dead on arrival. So still very um, fluid situation still developing. We do know that now BSO is the lead on this investigation. And as we learn more, we'll continue to keep you updated on air and online. But for now, reporting live from Lauderdale by the Sea, Anna McAllister, CBS News, Miami.